So the big question is this, how do investors like us who trade options and manage our own money generate income regardless of where the stock market goes and do it all in a way that lets us make time for the people and things we love and yet still build wealth and remain profitable? That's the question and this podcast will give you the answer. I'm your host, Kirk Duplessis, and you're listening to The Daily Call from Option Alpha. Hey everyone, Kirk here again at OptionAlpha.com and welcome back to The Daily Call. Today, we are going to be answering another user question and basically, actually, it's a question that we get all the time, but we just recently got it from a user and that is how to create an iron butterfly on Thinkorswim's platform. So Thinkorswim and TD Ameritrade, that's a platform that we have used for a long time, still a platform that we are going to use when we roll out our auto trading software and we'll be connecting directly with TOS and uh, TD Ameritrade. So if you have a brokerage account there, You'll be eligible, I guess, to do the auto trading. If you don't, you want to get a brokerage account there, head on over to optionalpha.com slash TOS. So inside of Thinkorswim, though, they don't have the ability to directly do an iron butterfly the way that we typically define an iron butterfly, which is basically short strikes at the same strike price, like a straddle. So basically it's a synthetic straddle and then long strikes out on either end. So what you have to do is you have to do it two different ways. So I'll explain the two different ways that you can do it here on today's daily call. The first way that you can do it is you can add an iron condor order to your, I guess, position screen or trade screen, and then manually readjust the strike prices as you see fit. So right now the S&P, the the time that I'm recording this is basically around like 275, 270-ish. And so if you want to add an iron condor, you could just right click on any of your short strikes that you want, go over to sell and then iron condor, and that would bring up an iron condor order. And then you could manually just change the inside strikes to be the same. So if you want to do a 275 iron butterfly, you change the short strikes to 275 or 270, you change the short strikes to 270. So that's one way that you can do it. It's a little bit more clicky and you have to just kind of like double check yourself when you do that. So that's one way you can do it. It's not my preferred way. Inside of Thinkorswim, one of the cool features that they have as far as shortcuts is you can use, in my case, the control key on a Mac, but I think it's the same on a PC. You can use the control key and you can hold that down and then manually click all of the strike prices that you want and it will automatically associate that trade together. So as long as you're holding down that control key when you're clicking different strike prices, it will automatically associate all those strike prices that you clicked into one single order. So what I like to do is I just like to hold down the control key, manually select the bid on the short inside legs. So that's in this case, I would do the 275 iron butterfly. So I would do a bid at or hit the bid at 275 on the call side, hit the bid at the 275 on the put side. And then I would buy the asks on either end. I would buy you know, say the 265 on the put side and the 285 on the call side, right? As long as I'm holding down the control key, it will just automatically associate these trades together. Now it's a little bit, you got to get over that learning curve of just holding down the keys and making sure you're clicking the bid versus the ask to buy and sell. But once you get over that, honestly, you do it two or three times, you're good to go. And it's much, much faster to be able to do this. Now, all of this is still manually clicking. So once we roll out our auto trading platform, you guys won't have to do this anymore. It can all be set up automatically with a bot. And the bot will figure out the strike prices, enter the trade, manage it, exit the trade if needed, all automatically for you. So that's what I'm really looking forward to as well. But if you're still trading on Thinkorswim, you're still doing this manually, that's how you create an iron butterfly on their platform. So until next time, happy trading. Thanks for joining us on The Daily Call. Be sure to subscribe right now for more daily options trading ideas, strategies, and tactics to help you learn how to play smarter, more profitable trades. And if you like what we're doing, don't forget to give us a rating and a review so we can continue to bring you the best daily content possible. We'll see you again tomorrow right here on The Daily Call from OptionAlpha.com.